What's up guys, my name is Zach Turlier and today we're in the community of Mahogany. Now, I've always considered myself an inner city guy. I wanted to be close to all the action, but as I approach my 40s and with a young family of my own, it's communities like this that are really starting to capture my attention. You've got Calgary's largest lake, the Mahogany Beach Club, parks, wetlands, all sorts of pathways. And let's not forget Westman Village with Alvin's Jazz Club, Chairman's Steakhouse, tons of pubs, analog coffee, you name it, this community has it. It's essentially a resort within a community. If you're thinking about starting a family, maybe you wanna plant some roots, I think this is a great community to do it. And the good news is we've got an amazing listing with tons of value to offer. It's only a few short blocks away. So why don't we head over there now and take you through it. Located in a quiet double cul-de-sac, this 2,400 square foot, four bedroom, three and a half bathroom home has everything your family needs and more, including a fully finished basement, air conditioning, a no maintenance yard with turf, a large deck with massive hot tub, and oh yeah, let's not forget the oversized double attached garage. On the main floor of this 2018 XL built home, you'll find a functional floor plan with nine foot ceilings, open riser staircase, as well as a gorgeous kitchen with top of the line appliances, all which overlooks the cozy family room with gas fireplace, as well as a large dining area. Okay, let's stop and talk about this kitchen for a second because I think it's important. This is where families spend the bulk of their time. It's also where buyers spend the most of their money when they're purchasing new construction. And these homeowners, well, they went above and beyond. They purchased almost every upgrade imaginable in this kitchen. You've got quartz countertops, this beautiful navy cabinetry and built-in shelving for wine. If you guys follow some of my videos, you know that I drink a lot of wine. So this is an important feature for me. You've also got lots of seating for guests. I don't know if you can tell or not, but we're we're facing west right now, so we're getting a lot of natural light that's flowing into this kitchen. Helps to showcase some of the stainless steel appliances. You've got a double door fridge over here with ice maker as well as the integrated water. You've got a built-in range with microwave. Right here, you've got a built-in electric cooktop as well as a nice stainless steel hood fan. When looking at this, one of the things that really grabs my attention is the cabinets go all the way to the ceiling. That's a really nice upgrade. The builder will charge you anywhere from like $6,500 to $7,000 for that. They've also got this nice tile backsplash which goes all the way up to the ceiling. I mean, with large families, one of the things that's really important to have is storage. This property has a ton of it. I wanna give a shout out to XL Homes because I know over the years, they've redesigned a lot of their product just to allow for more space for families so this is super functional and then another real cool space that I want to show you guys and it's actually just on the other side of my videographer so we'll flip around Levy and we'll show them this this is a little flex area I don't know what else to call it I think the builder though they built it with pets in mind and that's what the current owners are using it for they've got a little hamster here they've got three dogs and so they've set it up with some of their eating bowls and dishes over here but if you wanted to make this a functional space for you and your family you could probably turn that into a little office quite easily before we head upstairs I want to show you guys real quick you've got a two-piece powder room and then behind me you've got this really large mud room double attached garage to my left but this shelving system is really nice you can put your shoes below and then this is just where you hang your hoodies or your hats odds and ends it's all built in I think it looks really nice head upstairs I'll show you guys around Upstairs, you'll find a large bonus room plus a dedicated laundry space, as well as a primary suite with five piece ensuite and a spacious walk in closet. You'll also find two large kids' rooms, as well as another four piece bathroom. I really like this ensuite because it gives me some of the features that I don't have in my current home. For example, although it has two sinks, they're both completely separate by this soaker tub. My wife and I, we always get into a bit of an argument because I leave stuff out onto my counter and she's always cleaning up after me. In an ensuite like this, we don't have to worry about that. She's got her own space over there. I've got my own space over here and that's the way it should be. Back over here behind me, you've got a really large walk-in closet. Nobody's gonna be arguing over who has more room or who has more shelving. There's plenty in there. Toilet over here to my left, which is self-contained. Gives you a little bit of privacy first thing in the morning in case somebody wants to access the closet. And then last but not least, you've got this full walk-in shower with tile surround. Right now we're in the basement and this was just recently completed. As a matter of fact, they're just putting the finishing touches on right now. When they purchased this home, this was completely undeveloped. They wanted to take this out of the hands of the builder and do something really unique for themselves. So they built in a nice slat wood ceiling with LED pot lights. I'm envisioning a pretty cool space down here. I think you could have a nice long L couch. This would be a good spot to chill out with family, friends, maybe watch the game or a movie. 
could put a nice TV up on that wall for it. You could put a nice dry bar in there or maybe a foosball table. You've got a fourth bedroom and then this is really neat. This bathroom wasn't here before, but they've tied in all the colors from upstairs. So you've got this navy blue vanity with a really slick backlit wall. This thing actually lights up. And then instead of doing one of those cheaper, less expensive enclosures on the shower, they've actually done a full glass enclosure here and incorporated all the same tile that they have upstairs. So everything in this house is really cohesive. This is a functional space, an awesome basement for friends, family, or kids. That wraps it up down here. Let's take you outside, finish up the tour. Outside, you've got this beautiful west backing yard with a massive custom deck built in. Tons of space for patio furniture, maybe barbecuing, entertaining with family and friends. Back here, maybe at the end of the night, if you're looking to relax, you've got this huge eight person hot tub. But I wanna show you guys something really cool. So just bear with me a second. I'm gonna show you what's down on the ground level here. This is something I've been looking for at my house. It's a real neat high end turf system. This is actually artificial sod. It's actually durable, great for pets, really slick. You never have to mow it. It always looks good all the time. Cuts down on your landscaping costs. And then back here, this is kind of neat. They actually just set this up last week, but this is a built-in little fire pit area. I think it accents well with the hot tub and this pergola, making this one of the nicest yards I've seen in Mahogany. You know, I gotta say, when these owners first told me that they had converted their double attached garage into a full-blown gym, I was a little bit skeptical, but I've gotta say, it's actually a really good use of space. I don't know about you, but when I get home, I'm gonna have to do some hard thinking because after seeing a property like this in a community like Mahogany that's so amenity rich for families, I think I'm gonna have a hard time convincing my wife to stay where we currently live. So if you're looking for more information on this property, I'll leave a link in the description below. My name is Zach Turlier. Thank you for watching. All right, guys, you know the drill. It's that time in the video when I ask you to subscribe to my channel because videos like this, they're not easy to make. As you can see, I'm already burning a lot of calories in this one. So do me that favor, hit that subscribe button, hit the notification bell, and we'll see you in the next video.